Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Your Drone Questions Answered. I'm your host, David Young. Today's question is, what is the status of the DJI drone ban in the United States? We get this question all the time on webinars, people emailing in, comments to videos. So we thought we'd give you the latest update. Today is November 27th, the day before Thanksgiving and here's where things stand at the moment. So first, if you are unfamiliar somehow, there is legislation that's been proposed in Congress which would effectively ban all future sales of new DJI drone products in the United States, essentially by placing them on a list that's managed by the Federal Communication Commission, FCC, which means it wouldn't allow DJI, these drones, to use the spectrum in the United States, which allows them to communicate drones to controller, things like that, effectively rendering them useless. This bill is HR 2864, Countering CCP Drones Act. So this act was proposed in the House of Representatives. It was passed there in early September and sent to the Senate. Now, originally this was gonna get wrapped into the NDAA, the National Defense Authorization Act, which basically funds the military. But over in the Senate, where it has to get passed, the NDAA does not have this act included in it. However, it is still sitting in the Senate. If you look here on the screen, it says, on September 10th, it was received in the Senate, read twice, and referred to the Committee on Commerce, Science, and Transportation. If you're like, what is that? Essentially, it's just a committee within Congress that looks at legislation like this. So they have to review it, talk about it, and see if they can propose it to be included in the NDAA. Now, from what we've heard, this seems unlikely to happen this year. So as of now, the Senate does not have this act rolled into the National Defense Authorization Act. So it would have to be either subsequently put into it after it was reviewed by this committee or passed separately, which means it would have to take priority over a bunch of other items that are currently being considered by the Senate. So if you like DJI and you don't want this to pass, things are looking better for you. Doesn't mean it's not gonna pass ever, but at least right now it seems to be in sort of a limbo stalled out state there really hasn't been any action on it since early September, and who knows whether it's going to be included or picked back up. Another interesting thing to note is that Elise Stefanik, who was the original sponsor of the bill, has been nominated to be the UN ambassador. So if her term runs up and she goes and becomes the UN ambassador, maybe she's not around to lobby for it as hard. It has already passed the House where she sits anyway, so I'm not sure how much of an impact that has, but just thought that was interesting to note. Another thing to note is that DJI shipments were also being held up at Customs. So Customs and Border Patrol were holding on to these drones and not releasing them after they got into the United States to suppliers. Reasons outside of the act were cited about human rights concerns somehow being tied to DJI. But last I saw, these shipments were being released, so this was more of just a holdup rather than a permanent thing. So technically, the Countering CCP Drones Act is still alive for now, although not much movement, and who knows what will happen in the end. If you're watching this on YouTube or somewhere else where you can leave comments, I'm curious below, let me know what you think is gonna happen. Is this act gonna go through, and are future DJI drones gonna be banned? or not. Another thing to note on this topic, a question that we get a lot is, should I buy a DJI drone if they're gonna get banned? So this is just gonna affect the sales of future coming DJI drones, not existing drones. So all of the drones that are here in the United States right now, you can buy, you can trade without any issue. It's just they're not gonna approve new drones to operate on the US radio spectrum. So if you want a DJI drone, there's one you're looking at, you would actually probably be better off going ahead and buying it now while you still can if this act actually gets pushed through somehow and gets passed. All right, hope you enjoyed that update. Let me know what you think in the comments. I'll see you on the next one.